Well, I flooded the canals again, like to its maximum. Sadly, I didn't flood it from the from the side that I actually wanted it to get flooded. I flooded by mistake from this side, but hey, it's working, right? Let's to the man. Welcome back to Timberborn. I need my today's to the man. <laughs> We're gonna lead a little pack of beavers into victory at some point, I guess. As soon as the goddamn drought will end. Game. Yeah, okay, good thing I've managed to secure like a bunch of water thanks to my new ass dam over here. So that's great. But then again, I have to... Yeah, we need to get some water into this canal and I have to block it then. So it's so it will stop to escape it. So that's like I think for today. But last time I've said that I wanted to go into production of dynamite. And there's a bit of a problem because I've noticed that this thing requires a resource that I don't have access to yet. Yeah, metal. And well, to get metal, you have to get to the ruins, which are over here. And guess what? I don't have access because it's too far away. So what we need to do? We need to get ourselves a new district over here and hopefully get somehow into, well, ruin scavenging, I guess. I'm gonna be like a stalker beaver. Also, I was thinking about using this thing, you know, because uh, I got a pump here, that's true, but I would like to use this place to fuel up some of my industry. Which I hope is actually gonna work. So I will also want to develop a bit of a fix over here. Let's see, where's the landscapes? Okay, there it is. Now, how I want to do this thing. For sure, I need to break up the road. Because otherwise, I won't be able to build anything over here. And landscaping. Let's see. So, I want to definitely block this thing entirely. I want to make a narrow passage for the water to generate maximum power. Maximum frost. So if we're gonna do something like this, uh, something like this, I guess, and then the dam over here, right? So this should generate lots of power. I will have to get rid of those bushes over here, though, sadly. And with that thing done, power, water wheel, let's see. Can I do something like this? Yeah, I think it's gonna work, actually, you know? It's gonna look really goddamn fancy as well. So, if I'm gonna build this thing somewhere here, what I need for this thing? Okay, we didn't get- I got access to all of that thing, so this should actually work. Yeah. Don't build it though, just yet. And I need to figure out how we can put the beavers down here somehow. So for that thing, I need something to build down. Okay, just in case, temporary. Don't build this section here. Just so I'm gonna have a passage. And after all this thing will be built, then we're gonna think out about something else. Also, as soon as this water is gonna uh, be inside of this canal thingy, I need to get myself a grill. I need to get myself a grill and we need to get ourselves like some better food production because this is not going, man. This is not working, that's for sure. Uh, beaver hive. Yeah, having this thing as well would be nice, but I need paper. Which, guess what? I don't have access to, yet. So that's like another thing I have to do, eventually. But okay, for now, stick to potato production and we need to get ourselves a grill. And with a grill, hopefully, because I'm getting actually low on food. So you'll see how that thing is gonna go. I'm gonna need a road over here. Fancy! Yeah, and I think we're gonna make like a big ass field over here. So... When due times will come, do I, have, do, I, do I want to have the biggest storehouse? Oh, this is not gonna work, man. I think I prefer the smaller one. Oh my god, they actually managed to drain all of the water from this from this place. That's not good. Good thing that the drought is ending, but I'm just gonna add a bit of water over here, just in case, because I really prefer to keep my farmlands, you know, like, alive. Okay, the water is not going through. There you go. Okay, water is returning. Uh, the actual fields are not damaged, so that's okay. If the fields would get damaged, then I would probably get worried, but... Yeah, the fields are not getting damaged, so that's okay. There you go. Okay, and I can now close the dam. Beautiful! Hydraulics are the best, man. Made by fucking beavers. Okay, water goes through. It's gonna fill up all of this thing. Oh, yeah. And this plant have turned it into green. 
Come on, feel it up, boys. I want to see the, the water go through this staircase over here. Oh, come on, man. You should have enough water. Actually, I could probably put like a... Like a wheel over here. Oh, it's not gonna fit. Okay, I have to remember to put this thing... Make this thing uh, wider next time. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the water came back. <laughs> the water came back. Okay, right. We got a bit of a water over there. So that's okay. So now, block this. So the water won't escape. And we can lower up a little bit the dam. And the water flows! Yay! Just not gonna now fill up the next uh, the next like canal, the next section of the of the dam. And as soon as I can, I will build this thing here. And guys, come on, build it. Thank you. Okay. So this one is gonna fill up with water, so for this pump to work. And then, of course, we're gonna fill up the rest of this canal with, well, more water. <laughs> I am a water engineer from now on. And because now I got water in those little canals here, we can actually use this farmhouse here. So, potatoes. I want potatoes in my life. Hell yeah. All this shit will turn into potato land. Oh yeah. Glorious. Glorious potatoes. Mash potatoes. Really, I cannot build anything over there. Oh, for crying out loud. Thank you. So the plan is that I'm gonna have two powerful wheels over here that are gonna fuel up my industry thingy over here. So... Uh, gear workshop. Yeah, I'm gonna need some more stairs around here, actually. Ooh, good damn it. Okay. Alright, what about this thing? Oh, seriously? You got a completely different... Oh, <laughs> This will fit perfectly almost over here, so that's okay. And gear workshop and this okay, we exactly have the same goddamn layout. That's annoying. That's seriously annoying. Okay. Okay, game, you want to play the hard way? No problem, let's play the fucking hard way. So my production center is gonna look something like this. There's a warehouse underneath all of those buildings. Actually, there's some free space over here that could. I could try to use something here, like build something here. I don't know, we'll see. Uh, but basically the concept is that there is a warehouse underneath all of those houses. Uh, I mean, all of those factories. And then we got the paper mill over here. We got the gear workshop over here. And then we got, of course, the lumber mill over here. So hopefully that's gonna work. And with that thing, power. Yeah. I need more science points. Okay, that will have to wait a little bit longer. In the meantime, potatoes are growing, boys. Uh, empty the storage. Actually, no. Hold on a second. Don't accept anything. Anything, I said. Don't accept anything. Grilled potatoes. Okay, that's going to come in time. Okay, now we go into potatoes. What the fuck are the pot potatoes? Maximum efficiency. Okay, and with that thing, I wanted to make myself a grill thingy over here. Which, guess what? I need more fucking science! Huh, there's a bit of a water overflow problem over here. Interesting. Also, I think I'll have to build those things on, uh, like, platforms and stuff. Okay, this is actually bad. This is, this is not working as intended. So, we're gonna delete those. I'll delete those. And I'm gonna build here... Uh, some dams so that I can control the water flow manually if I have to. There we go. Don't tell me that they. Okay, I, for a second, I, they flooded my goddamn farming area. I already got difficulties with food. Thank you so much, game. Wait, where the fuck did my water escape? There was water over here. Where the fuck is my water? It closed the floodgate. What the heck? Is there like a hole in the ground or something? I don't think so. My fucking water just escaped. Now I have to store water once again over here. What? 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 Why? Why did my water escape from this place? Hey! Game! The shit! Okay, the water goes in. Okay. Just as plants, keep on going in water, keep on going in, don't be fucking, gen like, shy. Unless it 
No, it could not escape over here. Okay, what is inside? Close the gate. Close the second gate. Open up the dam. Wh what the fuck has happened? The water was not supposed to run escape from this place. This is not going according to plan, guys. So I got that thing working. Uh, time to put this bad boy here. So the jaw... Oh, shit, this is not gonna work. This is not gonna work. This is gonna definitely not work. I need to have a platform here. Power. Wait, maybe it actually... Oh no, this is gonna work. Okay, good. So this thing goes here. This thing goes here. Then... Connect this. Uh, yeah, go with this one here. Shit, I'm not gonna get connected to that thing, though. Crap! That's not gonna work. That's definitely, definitely not gonna work. I will have to do some pulling around, I guess. Uh, okay. Also, I need to rise this thing. There you go. Okay, connect this. Connect this. Those things goes here, and I cannot do a jack shit here because, well, guess what? No goddamn direct connection. Shit. Uh, power. Turn this, and then we need to delete this road. Because guess what? I cannot do anything over here. There you go. That works. God damn it, the water escaped again. Why? Why does the water keep escaping? You're not supposed to escape from this place. How? How is this remotely possible? Oh, I think I have to build a bigger dam over here. Oh no, the triple flood gate? I don't have science points for that thing. Shit! Okay, this problem with the little canal I have built is actually a real s s threat right now. Th this is starting to be a bloody ass annoying, annoying thing. How I can fix this? How I can actually fix this shit? Hmm... Some of the water needs to go here. Like, actually go here, but... I think I have to make a bigger floodgate. Yeah, we have to make the bigger floodgate over here. So that I can go... I can go above. Of this. Of this entire thing. So the water actually is gonna stay inside of this. Right? Yeah, something like that, I think. Because then... I could try to make this thing. It's gonna allow some of the water to go in. Some of the water to go in. Not a lot of the water, but some of it to go in. Right? If I'm gonna block it at this level. But if I'm gonna block it at this level, then that means that the dam will have to stay up all the time. Just to fill up this space. Unless I'm gonna build those things all over the place. Or, I could try to do even something more stupid. If I'm gonna destroy those... Build them in front... Okay, I have to actually make one more of those. So build something like this. Then build the floodgates are again over here. Which is gonna kinda look ridiculous, but okay. The problem is that the water overflows over here and escapes. So, what I need to do... Uh, okay, we have to actually do a few things. First of all, I have to get myself a distribution post. Somehow. Somewhere. Oh my god, this thing is... Wow, this thing is a lot bigger than I have expected. Wow. It's like the biggest building in the entire game. I'm not even like lying at this point. What the shit is this thing? Wow. We have to be this huge? What she said. Wow, this is dumb. Where the hell I'm supposed to build this shit? No idea. It's working, boys! It's working! Look! The master engineering of the beavers! Yeah, we got lots of power from those wheels. Then that they don't get transferred into this like little factory sector that I have. Oh yeah. Woodnology, boys! I call this thing from now on Woodnology. And it is perfect. Okay, so we got this thing covered. Uh, I still have to like redo the dam so that somehow we can bring water into the canals over here. So for that thing to work, I need to rise the level of water. Okay, and to rise the level of water, we have to block this thing here somehow. Okay, so... I have... 
Howling posts, distribution posts, drop off points. Okay, wait, did, did we actually build a distribution post? Because that's pretty important. Yes, we did. Okay. We actually got some, some guys over here. That's nice. Uh, wait, so if all of them are working there... Okay, I need to actually build myself another housing. Yeah, I built like this lovely little housing here. Look at this thing. It looks nice. So we can add one more. Actually, can I get the bigger one? I need some more science. Nine people live inside. Okay, actually, let's stick for the smaller ones for now. Uh, make me a road. There we go. Yeah, I'm making use of the canals, boys. And we can add this uh, potato fields over here so my farmers will have something to do all day. Okay, that works. Uh, actually, you know what? I want to move one of those. Yeah, I would love to move those over here. Like, one of them at least. Hmm. Let's build you... Okay, let's build you like... Th no, wait. Let's build you like this. I'll have to remove the fields. Underneath you. I think. I don't think you can work with fields around with this thing. Uh, too high. Perfect. And staircases. Right, and then some roads. Brilliant! But that's not the thing I wanted to actually do. We need... District center. This is what I need. So build this bad boy over here. It works somehow. It's flooded. You don't say! So that means I have to probably unlock the gates completely. For this area to get unflooded. There you go. Come on, boys. I need you to be unflooded, and I need you to be unflooded now. So we got those things, and... Okay, there we go. Right, so let's see. I need to have a drop-off points as well. Right, block up this thing completely. Okay, I think I want to make like a little, like... Like fake lake over here or something like that. So something like this. Uh, yeah, we can leave actually the buildings flooded. Why not? Okay. Nice. So how the hell does this thing works? No, this is a serious question right now. I'm not even joking. How the hell does it work? Because nobody gave me instruction. There's no the fucking manual over here. And... This thing must be separated by a gate. Are you fucking kidding me? Fine, you want me to be separate? You want to be separated, game? You want to be separated? Fine! Let's try this. Let's try this. And... The separation gates. There you go. You are now separated. How do you like it? Okay, I actually got some beavers. And I don't have any water. Ha! <laughs> Great. How the... Oh, make it population. Okay. Right, so I need to have a drop-off point as well. Where is the drop-off point? Uh, drop-off points. Oh, it doesn't cast any resources. Oh, how nice. That thing goes there. District distribution limits. We'll see about that thing. Okay, routes. Uh... I, how does it fucking work? Oh, so that's how it works. Add trade route. Okay, there we go. Now we need to have logs. Add trade route. Uh, you're gonna need some water. And add trade route. And what else? Logs and probably some planks. Okay, hopefully... First, bring them in some resources and then we can actually build that shit. Okay, some resources have arrived actually. Uh, I need some more guys over here. There we go. Okay. Now, migrate population. District 2. Migrate. It actually works! Holy shit! Took me a while, but this wall over here is finally finished. So I had to redo once again the floodgate for like the, f I don't know, fifth time? Fiftieth time? Yeah, I'll have to wait for my little guys to finish up this thing. What's your problem? Ugh, okay, well... This entire idea of building this canal over here worked a lot better on paper, okay? I'm gonna be completely honest with you. It worked a lot better on the fucking paper than it works in the actual game. Oh well. 
Nothing I can do with that thing, I guess. I need to store more water. Like, water is life. It's just like on a fucking dune, you know? Well, I flooded the canals again, like to its maximum. Sadly, I didn't flood it from the from the side that I actually wanted it to get flooded. I flooded by mistake from this side, but hey, it's working, right? <laughs> so that's what's important. So I wonder will the water now disappear if this thing is flooded? Hopefully it will not. I don't know. We will see. The biggest problem is, problem is that this thing is flooded now. I have, I think I have to make like a pump or something just to get rid of the water. But hell, at least the potatoes are now working as intended. I really need you guys to build this fucking floodgate over here because we're gonna have a problem very soon. Guys. You are not building the goddamn fucking thing. Okay, hold a second. Prioritize this thing. Uh, okay, and after that, prioritize this thing. And this thing. And this thing. I really need to build this things. Come on. More planks. More planks. Uh, planks. Thank you. Do, do I don't have builders something? No, I got I, I got like a lot of builders, but making anything over here at this point in the game is like a pain in the ass. I've closed up the gates, boys. Hopefully you'll be able to finish like the remaining stuff and the route is about to happen. Uh, well, okay, at least I got, like, <laughs> I think I got, like, enough water over here stored for the droughts. <laughs> so the first floodgate is basically to control the, like, the uh, amount of water over here and to speed up those things. And if I really get a lot of water, I just lower those. And there I go, we got water. And I got, like, a huge storage over here. Later on, the plan is to store water on this side. We just have to blow up, like, this entire canyon and I'm gonna store, like, water here. You also have to figure out uh, where to make the, make the settlement responsible for that thing. And I think I'm gonna change this thing because controlling two float gates at the same time is a bit annoying. I think I'm gonna just replace those things in the middle with float gates and those things with like the uh, dams. Yeah, that, that should be, I think, like a better idea. The dams over here, uh, sorry, the float gates over here are to control the water. Like normally they just the water just flows. But those things will allow me to uh, give water to the lower legions of my of my settlements, the ones that actually ha are responsible for making well surprise wood that is necessary for everything around here. But this looks nice. This is this is nice. This is very nice. So apparently, for the canals to, uh, um, it's like it feels like the canals eventually gonna dry out, you know. So that's why I've built like this lock over here. So this is how it works, right? You have to first block this thing in, right? The water should build up, I hope. Well, the thing is that the water can still like escape over here. So we have to build either here a bigger wall or do something over here. I don't know, we'll see about that thing. But the thing is that the water is supposed to rise and after the water will rise, I just lower up this thing, which open up the canal here and it just fill up with water. Yeah, well, right now it's filling from the different side, but that's okay, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> right, it should eventually meet a wall. There we go. So now this thing should start to fill up. And I don't think it's gonna fill up completely because this thing is slower than this thing over here. Yeah, as I said, it's still like requires a bit of a fixing here and there. But it's, you know, we are getting there, okay? We are actually getting there slowly and steady, but hell, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I'm running slowly and steady on my record time, so for now, I think I'm gonna have to leave this thing as over here. I don't know that I made enough progress today, to be honest with you. I think I haven't made that much of a progress. We will see. At the moment, I've built a farm thingy here, so hopefully my little beavers can take care of themselves on this side. Eventually, I'm gonna also give them like some wood and stuff like that. But the real goal is over here, the metal. So with the metal, I will be able to get like some more advanced stuff. And I was thinking, what should be the next goal of our little people? Well, I need to get dynamite, that's for sure. Uh, I could try to start to develop another district, actually, in a different place. I would love to... To move somewhere over here so we can blow up this thing later on and make myself like another water supply. Or make a big ass dam over here and block all of this water here as well. I mean there's some wood over here we could try to use. 
So that's fine. I could use that thing. And here goes the water level. Oh, crap. <laughs> yeah, well, the water level is a little bit too high. To my liking. So let's open the floodgates a little bit more. Come on, stop complaining. Stop complaining, guys. Come on. Open up. There you go. Yay, the water flows. Okay, lock it up a little bit. Actually, lock it up completely. Yeah, eventually the water will like go back to normal. Oh shit. Well, that was a, a bit of a problem over here, boys. <laughs> yeah, as I said, this all requires still like a, a bit of a fixing here and there. So eventually we'll get to that point. But that's gonna be the thing I'm gonna try to do in the future episodes. Uh, for now, the dam is working, I hope, as intended. I have to probably leave the game a little bit in the background just to test out is this actually like a good system. But after that, well, the world of Team Born awaits us. And I got some cool ass ideas for this thing, but that's gonna be the thing for the future. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the like episode. Episode, 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 epis